after I retired, I got busier than ever. <laughs> we are here to retire and have a leisure life, but uh, no, no longer leisure life because uh, we, we have been busy. We are known to be an integrator and uh, try to be mobilizer. When I moved here, I realized that uh, there are about 10% people of color are living in here they felt uh, they are still outsider. So I met several clubs and I asked them whether uh, they feel that we need to have some kind of activity so that we can get to know each other and be friends with all other people. They said, oh, that's a great idea. We will help you. Please, please help us to start. So we organized the planning committee. And then people started to join. And uh, we had a really successful multicultural festival in Leisure World. This was given to you by the president of Korea. Korea. The Korean people in Sacramento area, they were so happy when they heard about this. Sacramento people gave me big reception one day. When I left uh, two years ago, I established the Luke and Grace Kim endowed professors professorship in cultural psychiatry. I was able to do that by selling our house and the leftover I do donated to the university, $250,000, which was matched by the UC Davis $1 million. So I feel very proud of that. You know, he's a basically very uh, shy, and a humble person. And he does not brag about what he accomplished. But all his friends around him know what he had done. So that's why he received so many awards from American Psychiatry Association and the Korean American Psychiatry Association and the Asian Americans and the community. But he is a real thinker and a dreamer.